I just want to show you something quickly that I had Rodney East do. So he did it. Um, he played the song Thank You Lord and did it over the six. It's like a substitution for the six. So you know, usually we go. Okay, so this is in the key of F sharp, to G flat. So you go from the one, seven, six. Okay, so over that six, we usually play like a minor chord. What he did was he substituted that minor chord for a major chord. Okay, but here's the thing that I never. Um, this is one of the benefits. Okay, just be, I remember before I started learning to play out my other keys, I was always wondering what's the point of learning to play out of all the other keys? Because if you, so this was my understanding of learning other keys. You learn one key. And then you go to another key, then you learn the exact same thing, you learn another key. So you're ending up with the same information, essentially. It's just the one thing you can do in multiple keys. But that's not entirely true. You actually, there's so much benefit in learning your other keys. And I'll show you that now. So with that song, we're just playing Thank You, Lord. Okay, that... If you substitute that for a major chord, what that allows you to do is quickly for that time while you're staying on the six, you can go to the actual key of E flat. Okay? And then you can play some kind of progression on in the key of E flat. And then once you're done and you, you're, you're running out of time, then you can go back to the two in the key of F sharp. So you can change keys quickly. And so that's a benefit, I think, of um, learning all the other keys, because then you can take information from the other keys and just play it in to another key. You know what I mean? So in that case, like I said, we're going to the key of E flat. So the progression we're going to play in the key of E flat is a four, three, to six. Okay, so we're going to play a four. Okay, we're going to keep E flat now. So four. Playing this um, E flat major seven to the three, which is essentially like an E flat um, major chord, like a first inversion. Okay, and then on the six, we play like a C major seven, C minor seven. Sorry, C minor seven. So this is the voice you're going to play in the left hand, but you're going to take out the, the G, okay, and on this chord you're going to play a melody, okay, so that's E flat, D, E, B flat, E flat, okay, so we're going 4, 3, in the key of E flat. So that's a nice thing, you technically could have come up with any chord progression in the key of E flat and once your time is up you quickly go back to the key of F sharp okay, so that's one of the major benefits one of the whoo, when I discovered this I got excited okay so so in context oh and something I want to show you as well over the same so is this chord okay this is over the seven it's also like a F major seven F minor seven okay but he does this little thing where you go from the B flat to the C. So that's B flat, E flat, A flat. Okay, your left hand is F, E flat. To a diminished chord over the three. More like a marginal diminish, it's like a B flat seven. Once you're over the six, that's where you quickly go into the key of E flat. Then you go to the two, which is A flat, E flat, A flat, E flat, B, D flat, G flat, and B. Then you go to the four, five. Okay. I just wanted to show you that thing over the six, that substitution. So what you do is when you go to the six, you usually go minor. Depending on how much time you have, you can quickly go pretend like that's a major and then you quickly play something in that key, like any progression that you can think of or come up with. 
in the time that you have. So what Rodney did was, okay, so that's what he did. He did like a four, three, six progression in the key of E flat, and then to the two. Okay, that's it, guys. I hope that made sense. I hope um, you can use that concept and come up with all the new different progressions. And um, if you enjoyed that, um, I shot a video where I showed you my favorite chords, licks, and things like that. So if you enjoyed this, I think you'll love that. So just click the link below and I'll send you that video. Thanks again. See you soon. God bless. Bye bye.